Inauguration of Lot 1 of the Mixed Package of the University of the Gambia Development Project, Faraba Banta, 2nd March 2024. This is a dream come true for the late Vice President, His Excellency Ali Badra Juf, who pioneered this great project. Governor of West Coast Region, Honorable Usman Bojan, speaking at the event says, Faraba is an ideal place for this great institution because it is at the center. Faraba happens to be in the center of the urban rural mix of the West Coast region. Therefore, couldn't have a better place than here to build this university. To the Minister of Higher Education, Research, Science and Technology. Can accommodate 800 to 900 students. It has 18 classrooms, an auditorium, two laboratories, 38 offices, a conference room, a laboratory and two cafeterias. To highlight more on this, Vice Chancellor of the University of the Gambia, Professor Herbert Robinson. We witnessed the inauguration of Lot 1, comprising the School of Arts and Sciences, School of Business and Public Administration, School of Education, School of Information Technology and Communication, and the Library. We reflect on the journey that has brought us here. All the buildings are fully furnished with modern teaching and lab equipment, including smart boards, computers, and projectors. Faisal al Qatani Muhammad, head of delegation Saudi Fund for Development, says this organization has sponsored 19 projects over the past 47 years. He said funding educational projects is not only about education, but building communities. That's why they put $10 million in this project. ...of this journey with the Gambia, contributing 10 million US dollars to the construction of the state-of-the-art university campus. This state-of-the-art facility will not only provide a convenient environment for higher education, but it will also serve as a launching pad for scientific research and the development of a generation of... School of Education and Public Administration has capacity of 1,200 students, 44 classrooms, two auditoriums. Chairperson of the University of the Gambia Governing Council, Mr. Matthew Pindu, spoke of how it will be maintained. Um, an annual and detailed inspection tour of the campus in addition to receiving from management regular reports on operations and the state of the physical environment. On their part, management will judiciously execute the annual maintenance budget for the campus to prevent a deterioration of the facility or interruption of services essential for the smooth conduct of academic work and the sustenance of personal health. After 24 years of existence, the university now has a permanent place. The African Union recognized this year as the Year of Education, the School of Information Technology and Communication, and the School of Arts and Science has a total capacity of 400 to 500 and 900 to 1,000 students. The President of the Republic, His Excellency Adam Oboro, also says his government we are steadily and radically transforming the country's post-secondary education training, giving the urgent need to increase youth employment and fight poverty. The government has boldly embraced a robust transformation strategy for the higher education system. This new strategy is, by, is being piloted at the University of Applied Sciences, Engineering and Technology, UCEP. After declaring the Plot 1 project of the Faraba Banta campus inaugurated, the President also laid the foundation stone for Lot 2. In recognizing the late Vice President, His Excellency Ali Badrajouf, the library will be named after him. Reporting for N24, I am Lamin Ba.